Hi everyone! What is going on with my hand? Hi! <laughs> so guys, we are coming back today to play some more Rise of Shield Hero. Um, hopefully you guys will continue and enjoy this. Uh, as I said before in the last episode, this was a highly requested series that I complete for the YouTube channel. So we are going to continue to relive the animation that is the rising of shield hero as season two approaches really really close so i hope that you guys will join me um <clears throat> so the last time we left off uh mine basically was continuing to be a bitch like she was and i fucking hate her so much um and we looks like that we are headed to the path on trying to get our new companion well, I, wonder, I wonder what lies in store for us. If you haven't seen this already, you should know. But, uh, with that all being said, let us do this then. <clears throat> there we go. And I'm going to pause some music. Because, you know, we don't need the music. But, you know what? I feel, I feel a little saucy. I want to be in the middle now. I am between... I'm in between our golden girl and our lovely golden boy here. <laughs> All right, here we go. <clears throat> I'm in debt to the weapon shop guy. I could go earn some money by collecting monster materials in the forest. Uh, can, can you? Can you do that? Wait, wait, wait. The bag. Can I get the bag? How does one get to the forest from here? Can I get into the... So I don't know how they got to the forest. What? <laughs> what? Oh, is it out here? Okay, that makes sense. <clears throat> Hold on, guys. Shit's happening. Editing on the fly here. You know? Because some things can't stay the same. Don't know why. Anyway. Alright. Probably gonna speak on this. Cause goddamn that's loud. Small yellow shield. Yellow small shield. Unlocked. Ability unlocked. Defense 2. Okay, cool. This would not take that long. I, I don't think that it would take that long, probably.
Huff, huff, huff. It's about time we headed back to town to sell the our monster materials. We should search for somewhere we can sell our monster materials. How about here? Welcome, would you care to buy some medicine? I don't even know where the fuck he would go to sell this. No. Sure. I'm sorry, but I'm all out of crystal balls. Okay, but what if I wanted to sell you shit? I was so relieved to hear when I heard the four cardinal heroes had been summoned. But now my family is in danger, so I'm even more worried than before. Why? Why is your family- Well, for these things, how does one copper for a pair sound? Sure, I'll take that. Thanks. Come again? Oof. Welcome. Buy these, oh? Orange balloons, huh? Hmm. How does one copper sound? Didn't you offer that guy a one copper for two? Did I now? You must understand. I have a business to run. That's so. Will these things fetch a better price then? Yeah! They're pretty lively. Stop it, please! Take them off! I'm not trying to rip you off here. All I will ask is for a fair market price. Or wait. You hate me for some reason, maybe. I understand. So get these things off me. We have a deal. Sell all of them. Okay. Instead of trying to fleece me, if you buy from me regularly, I'm willing to give you a small discount. Consider it, son. As much as I'd like to refuse, the goods and money are without sin. Also, feel free to tell people all about me. Tell them that any trader that messes with me will end up with the bite marks all over. No need to ask me. I was just about to do that. As long as to a long business relationship. And it's just save up some money. I should go pay that back the weapon shop guy. Okay, so now we gotta go. He was like, no, no, no. He was like, oh. It... Hey, old man. Here's what I owed you. I wonder if there's a better way to make money than selling monster materials. Maybe I should ask around town. Yeah, you. Hey. You got some nerve lifting your hand against a comrade. You're supposed to be the shield hero, ain't you? This is Mellow Mark's castle, too. Eek! Okay. Cool. Hi. Cool. If you think you're gonna get me drunk and have your way, you've got another thing coming. Okay, not what I was wanting, but, you know, what else. Looking for new party members? Well, there is an adventurer in town who doesn't know your face and- <clears throat> Your infamous deed. It hasn't even been a day since you were summoned and you already are causing trouble. Never heard a hero like that before. Bruh. Fuck out everybody in this town, guy. Like, for real. If thought we were safe after a hero was summoned, but 
I no longer feel that way because of you. Thanks. Can't go. So where the fuck am I supposed to go? Aren't these... Medicinal herbs? They'll sell them for more, for more than little balloons, it seems. Maybe I can find some in the forest. Oh, so we're going back out to the forest. Got it. And an immediate attack with the balloon. He's now level two. That's helpful. Or is that just from him leveling up? I think that may be from him leveling up. Maybe? Easy, I guess. Oh. I wish there was a way to have both of them. Cause this just takes forever. I guess one more. Ooh, 
Ooh, okay. This is... Leaf Shield Unlocked. Abilidium. Gathering Skill 1. There might be more ahead. Go have a look. But... There's a there's a hill up here. Damn it. I mean, at least... At least I think we're getting some... I've collected a, quite a lot. Maybe I should head over to the app. Okay. Telepat. Teleporting. Got it. And I... I'm gonna go ahead and sell... Oh, okay. I guess I can sell the monster goods that I, I grabbed. Oh my god. <clears throat> wow. This is good stuff. Where did you get these? In the forest right outside the castle, didn't you know? Hmm. I never even knew you could find such fine stuff there. I was sure the quality was much more average. I spent a couple of days making money from herbs and getting experience from <sighs> Ever since that day, nothing I eat has any flavor. Oh, Shield Hero, we'll join your party. Yeah, yeah. Thank your lucky stars. Let's go ahead and discuss the terms first. Okay. Your pay will be entirely performance based. I trust you know what that means. Nope, no clue. It means that you'll be paid according to the loot we get on our, our, our on our average. Team leaders, so you'll take at least 40%. I'll split the rest in my discretion. If you do nothing, you get paid nothing. The hell? That means you can keep it all for yourself. I promise to pay you if you do your job. You can do your job. Let's get us some equipment then. Buy your equipment yourselves. I have no reason to do that much for you. Huh? Forget it, just hand over your money. If you said so, that to begin with, we could have saved some time. What do we have here? Aren't you awfully obedient? <laughs> Quit freaking out! Ow! Shit. I have the defense, but I lack offensive ability. Because I lack it, I can't defeat monsters. Because I can't farm, my offensive ability never goes up. What an awful cycle. Damn it. <sighs> you seem to be having trouble. You don't have help, but I have just what you need. If you're offering me party members, thanks but no thanks. Party members? 
Please, what I'm offering you is of a service far more convenient. What would that be? Interested, are we? Get away from me. That look in your eyes. The kind I love. You're every bit of the man the rumors said you were. You know who I am? Of course I do, shield hero. If my offer interests you, please follow me. Here we are. So what exactly are you offering me? Can't you tell at a glance? Slaves! Slaves? Yes, I run a slave trading business. What makes you think I want a slave? The fact that they cannot lie or betray their master. Slaves are placed under the effect of a curse. A strong seal, a strong seal-based curse that can take their very lives. What do you say? Show me what you've got. I knew it. You can have everything it takes to be a most wonderful patron. <sighs> I see ones that aren't human, too. You can call them human, technically. Tell me more. I don't know much about this world. Creatures that look human, but aren't, are called demi-human. They are mostly used in manual labor or as servants. Beastmen are demi-humans whose appearance leads more towards the animal side. They are used as bodyguards or as participants in death matches that are gambled upon. I see, but they fall both uh, but they both fall under the same category, huh? Indeed, and since some demi-humans are thought to be closer to monsters, life would be hard for them in this game, which practices human supremacy. As such, they are treated as slaves. This slave here is my recommendation. Level is 75. How much for this one? Well, it's highly capable in battle. How does 15 gold pieces sound? Showing me your most expensive slave knowing that I can't afford it, huh? Indeed, you will show to become one of my best patrons, though I need you to develop a keen eye, you see. Well, now that you've seen my best, let me ask you, what kind of slave would you like? One that's cheap and obedient. In other words, a demi-human. These aren't suited for combat or, or manual labor. If I need them in battle, I'll train them. That's an amusing response. When you don't believe in people. Slaves aren't people. Training one is no different than upgrading my shield. <laughs> well, you've got me there. <coughs> that half raccoon is diseased and has a mental disorder. I'm having a real hard time with her myself. Her previous o owner loved her t his torture, you see. I doubt she'll last much longer. I've decided. I'll take this one. Let's begin. Hey. <clears throat> Worry not, the pain will dissipate soon. The slave crust on her chest makes it impossible for her to fight to defy you. <coughs> Acquired slave A. Hmm? Party member settings. Now this girl is all yours. 30 silvers, right? There's one extra in here. That's your commission. You were going to wring it out of me anyway, weren't you? You certainly know your stuff. Well, I guess I should know your name. <coughs> Tell me your name. What is your name? R Reftalia. Reftalia, huh? Let's go. Beep. I'm looking forward to your next visit. 
Oh, he really did choose him. I'm getting goosebumps. Welcome. Oh, it's you, kid. Hey, hey, what's with the girl? Give me a weapon she can use. Keep it under six silvers. Took you long enough. Sorry. Whatever. Reftalia, draw your knife. Huh? Yes? Let me see if you can stab and burst this thing. No. This is an order. You only hurt yourself by refusing. Do it. Do it. Put more heart into it. Do it. I got XP too? Probably because you set her as a companion when forming the pact. Wait. You didn't do that with the lady from before? Damn them. Listen up. Eep. From here on out, I expect you to fight monsters for me. I bought you with what little money I had. You'd better help me recoup your cost at least. Kid, you're not going to die a painless death. Thanks for the compliment. Quit sitting around, let's go. Yes! Sheesh. I don't know whether it's our country to blame, or if the kid's just been corrupted. Save your progress? Yes, I think I will. And I think that this is a good place to stop for today. So guys, so excited! This is the third episode done, and oh my god, we finally got Reptilia! Yay! So next time when we play, we will learn a little bit more uh, about everything. Sorry for the speed up parts. I know that you guys probably want to see all of the fighting and everything. However, it just did come a little bit repetitive. So I did try and make that as simple as possible. But I do love you guys. I love your faces. And I hope to see you guys all in the next episode where we continue Reftalia and Nalfumi's journey. And yeah. <laughs> Bye.